Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to the Football Corner. Welcome back to another live stream, another show, another video on the channel. Um, big ups to everybody that is tuned in nice and early. I don't know why I can hear myself for some weird reason. Um, no, it's everybody... someone's phone going off. One of these frauds. I don't know, I don't know who was watching the stream on their phone. But um, listen, <laughs> big ups to everybody who is tuned in nice and early. Uh, big ups to you guys. Make sure you are smashing the like button. Make sure you are subscribing. If you haven't already, make sure to get that done for me. As you can see, it's a bit, the screen is, the camera is different. Yeah, that's because I got an, uh, I got I updated my setup a bit. I got a new TV, this and that. You know what I mean? We Oh, yeah, different we're, angle. We're, I just up, got, we're, I just up, got we're upgrading, we're upgrading. Yeah, 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 yeah we're man, upgrading. Yeah. You know what I mean? We're, yeah, I'm, putting, I'm putting the money back into the setup. I'm putting the money that I make yeah, back into uh, the content and back into making sure that I can provide you guys with the best of content. As always, you already know, um, all I ask from you guys in return, all I ask from you guys in return for me making investments to make the content better for you is that you smash the like button for me. Make sure you're subscribing me. to the channel as well. There follow you go, you fraud. There you go. Make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification so you're notified every time I make a video, I go live anything to do with that so make sure you're getting that done for me people um yes exactly g's just there just like <laughs> until you're done i'm gonna keep my thumb up until you're but listen make sure you're liking the video um we are i am joined today for the pre-match i am joined with my brothers here um we are joined with the main man hooks the main man the sicilian guna himself yes and we are joined by t and the t Stands for Turkish people. T stands for Turkish. So make sure to go and follow them, subscribe to them as well. Show them some love. Um, make sure to go and do that for me, people. But we are going to be speaking about the lineup. So let me get them up right now. Let me go and get this lineup right now up for both teams. Mm. We are going to be discussing this right now in the pre match. So as you can see, starting off with the home team, the Arsenal, we are going out with a lineup of Raya in between the sticks. We have Benny Blanco, Saliba, Gabriel, and Kivior in the back line. With the midfield three being Rice, Jorginho, and M08 in the building as well. With the front three, which uh, put a smile on my face, people. Put a smile on my face. It's not other than Bukayo Starboy Saka. It's not other than Kai. The GOAT Havertz. And it's none other than Gabriel <laughs> Rapido Martinelli is back in the starting 11, people. Back in the starting 11. Big up Martinelli. Back there. Finally arriving back into the starting 11. We are gassed to see what he is going to do for us today. Now, moving on to the Bayern Munich starting 11 for this game. Manuel Neuer, captain's aside. He is their skipper for the day. Um, he is starting off in between the sticks. The back line is Joshua Kimmich, um, Eric Dyer, um, wow, um, Matthias De Litt and uh, Afonso Davies in the back line. Uh, the midfield three is... The lift, by the way. Uh, yeah, I know, uh, right? Such a fraud. The lift. The lift. My bad. Um, That's a delight, you know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, my bad, bro. My bad, my bad. Um, <laughs> in the midfield three, uh, we have Limer, we have Goretzka, and we have Jamal Musiala in the building. Um, and for the front three, we have Leroy Sane, we have um, up, up number one, and we also have it's none other than Serge Gnabry making his return again. My boy. Making his return. Making his return to the Emirates um, where he was born. The Emirates where he was. Um, he grew up here, man. You know what I mean? He's one of our own, man. He's one of our own. Um, unfortunately, he did have to leave under some unfortunate circumstances. But listen, lads. 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 Now that I think about it, I would have so much rather we got rid of um, Oxlade-Chamberlain instead of him. Can't oh, Bayo's here. 
Dio's here and, and I didn't even I was my bad Dio. I was on I was on the other screen, so I couldn't even see the thing, bro. But big up to you. But lads, how are we feeling about this starting eleven? How are we feeling about Martinetti? Um, how are we feeling about give you a left back? I can't lie, I'm seeing Jorginho in the squad. I didn't mind it to be honest. I wanted party personally for me. My preference was to start party, but Jorginho, he's still there. He's got the he's got the um He's got the experience in the Champions League. That's that's something that's key. Uh, for First, Eugene, bro. do you know what I'm sad, saying? Sad. Can I just say, sad? bro? Like I can't lie. I think like a lot of Arsenal fans have been mad confident, but you you, you yeah, can't yeah. look at that. You can't look at that Bayern team and start thinking we're going to slap these Don's easy, bro. No, I, I don't. I don't think that. Not I you. Think... No, I know, I know you. Not I was you. fighting. I, mean, I was Arsenal fighting, fans, for... but Arsenal fans, because I'm looking at that Bayern team now, and I'm saying, boy. Boy, listen, you see that front three when, oh, when you're talking to Arsenal, Arsenal fans, fans. G, when you're talking to Arsenal fans, there's only one guy that you need to speak to, <laughs> and it's this guy bro. right here. Yeah, that's the only guy you need to speak to. Bro, Not I mean, me, bro, bro, I always... everyone, everyone talks about signing, everyone talks about signing Sane or or or, or Gnabry back at Arsenal and happily having them back. And we all know Harry Kane would get straight into our team. So that front three there, yeah. Well, we're gonna have to see, man, how how Kivior's gonna deal with Sane today and stuff. But our team, I, I'm I'm happy with our team. I probably would have stopped started Tommy Asu left back. Um, Jorginho, I think for the Champions League, and that that's perfectly fine. Martinelli back in the team, that's perfect. Uh, I think that the reason Martinelli hasn't been playing loads of minutes, I think Arteta's kind of been saying, let me leave him and unleash him on the Champions League. Sort of give him bits and minutes, make him a bit hungry, and then let him go in the Champions League. Um, against uh, a Bayern team like this. But listen, it's going to be a good game, man. But the teams, for me, it's what I actually expected us to probably go with. I, I thought Martinelli would be back in the team. Uh, the only thing is, though, maybe Partey might have been might have been a good choice in there. But at the same time, he's, he's not really had much game time. So you could argue that. So I'm, I'm pretty happy with the team, man. But that Bayern team, boy, that, that's not... Alfonso Davies against, uh, on that side with Gnabry against like, Ben White. Like that's gonna be, it's not gonna be easy for us today, man. That's why if we win, it's it is an accomplishment. That's why no one should think that it's gonna be easy and we're guaranteed to smash these men because of league form and stuff. Uh, because you see that team and you know that's the same exact team that won on their shit last year and that. So you know they can mm. turn it on. Yeah, listen, I, I I completely agree with you, my brother. Uh, uh, listen, I I think this Bayern team. It's full of experience. It's full of experienced heads that have been in this competition. They know exactly where it is to play in the Champions League. Do you know what I'm saying? They know how to how to handle games. They know they know um, you know how how to be. They know they know how to handle these big stages. Yeah. Right now, um, if I look at the Porto game that we played at home. There was still a bit of nerves there. I could see that there was a bit of nerves. This is a young team. I expect them to have nerves. I expect them to be a little nervous because it's the first time in the Champions League. You're coming up against the elite of the elite. Do you know what I mean? So there's obviously going to be nerves. Um, I do still think we'll win. I just I don't think it's going to be uh, like a 3-1, 4-1, 5-1, whatever people are screaming. I, I Definitely don't think that's gonna happen. I know people are looking at the, the back line, they're saying, Oh, how how is Eric Dyer in that back line and you man are not confident? Bro, that means nothing. These guys, I can tell you right now, they're gonna play in the back three, yeah. So they're gonna play a three at the back. I can tell you that right now, just from seeing Joshua Kimmich in that right back position. He's gonna get into the midfield and they're gonna play a back three. We know that already. So yeah, listen, it's, it's, it's definitely going to be an interesting game. Wait, wait, wait a back, but I'm you, excited. You fear, you fear a back three of Eric Dyer, the lit, and Alfonso Davies, who is not a defensive minded player. Well, but he can, listen, he can they, sweep. He can they're, sweep. They're, bro. They're, they're, I don't know whether they're going to sit back. We need to see how they play first. Because these guys very well may just sit back. Do you understand? <laughs> they may just sit back and just be like, you lot come at us. Can't us. You lot are the home team. Wait, but have you, have, you lot are you the ones that are. You honestly look at this this starting eleven. I so sorry, they're starting eleven, and think mm -hmm. that they they have any plans or desire to sit back. To me, it looks like a very offensive minded team, especially considering. So, so what's what's your thoughts then? Forever. Give me your thoughts, hooks. Give me your thoughts. <laughs> my my thoughts haven't really changed from from when we did the preview. Like, I mean, 
I, like I always knew that they had good players. Like it, it, it's not a surprise to me that I see Sane playing. It's not a surprise to me that I see Nabri playing. It's not a surprise that I see Kane. Like it's not a surprise that I see Musiala. Like yeah, like they have good players, yes, but that them good players haven't stopped them from taking certain losses in this season that I don't expect them to have. And it's just that simple. So that look like the, the the one thing that kind of has me a bit on edge is Jorginho. And not not because he's bad, but because they're playing with very pacey players, Musiala, Nabri, Sane. And if we if for some reason, some magical reason, we're ever in a scenario where you know we get caught out and it's Jorginho that has to chase back, he's just he's never gonna catch up to them. Like just he's just never ever gonna catch up to them. <laughs> so but I wanted Partey in. But I also understand why Jorginho's been played. So it's not that I don't want him there. It's just that, yeah. you know, he could get very exposed in this game. But mm -hmm. hopefully, hopefully Rice, Saliba, Gabriel, and you know what? Maybe that's why he's playing Kiwi off. Maybe he's playing Jorginho because he's playing Kiwi off. And there's now that extra kind of def the, the defensive guy. And, and you know what? Kiwi has got a decent recovery pace as well. So... So look, like, wait, 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 hold on. Why are we picking on Jorginho's position? And this guy has played in the Champions League more than any other player on that team. Bro, relax. The experience. No, no. I'm just saying, like, the experience that he brings. How dare you, Hooks? Stage, I'm not. How dare you? I'm not. No, no, no. I'm not saying. I'm not saying. No, no. I'm not saying Hooks. I'm not saying picking on in a bad way. That's not what I mean. I'm saying I'm happy he's in the team. Like he needs to be in no, the no, team. No, no, no. Yeah, no, look, I understand why he's in the team. It's like I said. I understand why he's in that team because obviously we're going up against a team who has a lot of experience in the Champions League. So we need to have players who also have experience in the Champions League because outside of Jorginho and Havertz, and I mean Havertz, even not really that much, who really has experience in the Champions Partey has experience, but again, not really that much. So I understand the Jorginho, but he, I mean, he, he, he gets exposed by pace. We, we always see... When people run at him, he just gets exposed. So when, when was the, when was the last time he got exposed by pace? When was the last game that you what, what the only the only you know, game the last time up, was on, the only when game he made that mistake season, against Tottenham yeah. in the first half of the season? That's all we've held on to. Yeah, Everything but how Arsenal fan had held on to. Hold on. I, 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 I got to agree with Dayo here. I don't, every he single Arsenal fan play. has held up held on to that one that one mistake, and this was against Tottenham in the first half of the season. Okay, tell me, tell me the, tell me the, the, the games, yeah, that he's played in, yeah, since then, where he's gone up against pacey players. Actually, wait, against, even, against Liverpool, wait, against last, Liverpool, wait, against, against Liverpool, he played. Bro, he, he went against Foden, bro. He went against Foden against Liverpool. He never got turned by Foden. He played Man City. We played teams like Brighton, who also have pace. We played teams like. No, no, um, no. But you're, you're, okay, I think Havertz should be on the bench. So, so my thing is this. So my thing is this. I, I think we should sell him, uh, Giuseppe. Oh, swear down. <laughs> no, no. My thing. Is, my, my thing is. T for Trossard is better than Havertz. Exactly, no, bro. Exactly. You know what? Jorginho, <laughs> Jorginho you know in the what? midfield. Jorginho you in frauds. the midfield. No, you went up frauds because none of you in the last game wanted to start Trossard. Only I said start Trossard. Only, only me. Only bro, we, we we are just joking, bro. <laughs> <laughs> only me, only me said start Trossard, didn't it? So, so remember that, innit? And I'm actually, but, I, I wanted Trossard to start this game as well. I didn't want Martinelli to start. But hold on, that's that's fine. I want to go back to Dale because I want him to say what he was saying about Jorginho. Hey, on, like, on, on, no, no, I, I think, I think, I think, I think Jorginho works in the midfield, especially how he's played mm. with Rice in in all the games that we've played so far. Yeah, he's been good. Um, he's splitting passes and then him controlling that game. Like Jorginho knows how to slow things down when when everybody starts acting crazy. Yeah, and another well, thing mm. that you notice about him is, like, he controls players. He tells them where to go, where to be. That way, he doesn't have to do the running. He's Jorginho is consistently doing this, 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 this. You there, you there, you like. He's literally coaching as he's playing. He's yeah. got that experience. That's number number two thing. Now, Partey for me would have been a great option, but he hasn't played many games. He hasn't. Let's just call a spade a spade. Thomas Partey is an amazing player, but you haven't played all season, man, bro. You probably played forty five minutes total in the last since you came back from injury. Some fifteen minutes here, some twenty minutes here, some thirty minutes here. His last game, he looked a little laggy. His passes were great, but he looked laggy. When they turned him mm -hmm. around and they got the ball from him, he was chasing. He was like two yards behind. 
So I'm not going to risk putting the party in now until I know that his fitness levels is right up there. So if we score two goals, maybe three, if we score two goals, then I can bring party in 20, 25, 30 minutes to the end of the game to shore things up a little more, you know? So you see? I, I, th I think, I think we're good with this, the lineup right now. Trust that for me, like I said mm. yesterday, I was, I was going to bring Trossard in the second half, but if Martinelli is not fit, then hey, great call. I can't lie, Dio. I agree. The thing is, I wanted to start party, yeah? But I understand why people want to start Jorginho. Like, I'm not completely against... I'm not against starting Jorginho. Like, I don't mind who starts. Because our team is so good right now, and because players are start. Like, how many... Let's just think back to the last time that we had a crop of players this good and a squad of players this good and we had a full squad, healthy squad, and we could actually have arguments like this about who look look at us, look at us bant bantering about who 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 should start and who should like I, no, I, this is crazy. Bro. Last time, <laughs> last time, crazy. I'm not gonna lie, last time I was still getting happy meals at McDonald's, mate. I was still getting happy meals. Yo, bro, this is no, crazy. It's, it's crazy to sit here and be like, oh man, because I know how good party is, and I'm just like, imagine if party came in for Jorginho, and we're like, okay, no, even like Martinelli is not playing and nobody's panicking. We're like, oh, trust out on the left, great, let's go. Like, like I, I can, I can understand. And, and let's I can also understand. give credit. Let's Jorginho. also give give credit to the players who didn't perform as well before and now are performing really well. Because yeah. normally, when Party was injured and uh, Jorginho was playing, we would scream, "When is Party returning? When is Party returning?" We did not want to see Jorginho play for this midfield. You know what I'm saying? Um, and this year, he is performing as well. Kivior is performing. So even our underperforming players are performing really well this year. You know what I'm saying? The only mm. player that is lackluster this year is still, uh, yeah, the number fourteen. I wouldn't even have called them. I wouldn't even have called them um, underperforming players because they were not getting the chance to play. So what were they underperforming? We we can't be labeling players like that. I think that's unfair. Like for example, let's be honest about it. A lot, Jorginho when he first came was not playing a lot of games, and then he played that Tottenham game. He messed up the season that one game, and everybody went, "Oh!" So we judge them by one game. The same way we judged Havertz by his first game. And now he's giving us output. The same way we, the same way we've judged in Ketia all through the season, but he's only played how many games and made how many appearances. His total minutes is one of the lowest in the whole squad, with with the likes of um, Cedric. So mm. what are we calling them underperforming for when we're not giving them the chance to even show what they can do? And when we've been giving them the chance, they've come up with the goods. A lot of these players, when Kiria was given the chance, he came up with the goods. When Jorginho mm. was given the chance, he came up with the goods. Let's not always Eddie, do when, this debate. No, no, no. Eddie when, hasn't. I know. Been no, no, no. But when, when Eddie played, on. when Eddie played three, four games back to back, he gave us his goods. He scored. When last season, end of last season, when yeah, when I Jesus when that. Jesus was out, who was scoring for us in the last four games? Let's stop this, you guys. We can't keep doing this to him. He's not okay. good enough for us now. Yes, well, I, I will yeah. keep so doing chance, this until he leaves, bro. Do you really think? Do you really think I give a shit about this guy, bro? It's the same way. It's, it's the same way. I, listen, it's the same way I said it, right? Trossard as a forward is not performing for me. Seven goals as a forward so far, and you've played more games than everybody. No. Wait, whoa, whoa, no. whoa, whoa, whoa. What did They're you not say? Performing. Yes, he's not. You, 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 you want to give. What did you say? Uh, but expect, okay, but Havertz is performing. Yes, Havertz is performing. Yes, Havertz is performing. He's an attacking okay. midfielder. Okay. How many minutes? How many minutes did uh, Havertz more. play? Uh, and how many minutes did Trossard play? That's like. That's like. Guys, are we gonna guys, do this? Guys, guys, are guys, we gonna guys, do this? Guys, are we gonna do this? Are we gonna do this? One, one is a twenty-nine-year-old winger. Listen, one is a twenty-nine-year-old winger who played. Oh. Anyway, can I talk for fuck's sake? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I, can I, can I, can I fuck him, bro! I say one thing. Lads, let's, well, let's uh, not, well, yeah, I'm just saying one thing. Yeah. Yeah. One thing. Yeah. This, this guy, this guy, this guy, just no, no, no. Listen, this guy, bro, are you a child? Are you a child? Are you a child? Are you a child? Why are you? Why are you repeating your? So, are we just? Are we just gonna have to do the thing like this, guys? Please, we're on a platform. We are not. We we are on a YouTube stream, bro. <laughs> we are not on this. I want. I want to give both of you opportunity to speak. Yes. So I'm gonna bring back Dio and T, <laughs> bro. What's going on? <laughs> I'm gonna bring back Dio and you know T. That. 
It's like Jeremy Cowan, you know, when it goes bro, off and he runs the stage. Like, <laughs> yo, I'm just like, bro, Jerry Springer, Jeremy Kyle, these type of guys, bro. They're just trying to chase each other, bro. Trying to fight live on stage. Um, Listen, I'm going to bring you guys back up. Yeah. And <laughs> I'm going to bring you guys back up. I want Titus to explain himself and then I want Dio to explain him. And then I want Dio to rebuttal it. Yeah. Let's just let T explain himself and then Dio, you can rebuttal it. Yeah. Bro, why would I ex why would I explain Eddie and Ketia, bro? This guy is literally trying to defend Eddie and Ketia, bro. What are we talking about, bro? Let's be real, man. And first of all, bro, do not ever do that ever again, bro. Stop putting down the players. Stop putting down the players, bro. Are you a child or something? Talk to me normally, man. What the fuck, bro? Come with points instead of being a child about it, bro. I will put down players that do not perform for this club. And then that I want to leave. And Adi Nketiah is one of them. I want him to leave. Okay? So if I put him down, that's my own choice. I will talk the way I want to talk. Okay? And nobody is going to change that, bro. Especially not you. And I will okay? talk to where I want to talk too. And you're not going to change that too. Especially Nobody not is trying too. to change you. Exactly. But nobody is so trying to change saying? you. So what but nobody is trying to change you. You want you want you you have your opinion about the squad, and I keep saying it's very simple for me. You is it you can you might say the eye test for certain players, they don't pass it for you. That's fair enough. There's certain players on the team that for me they don't pass the eye test. But when I look at what they're giving the team, right, yeah, and what and what they bring to the team, mm -hmm. I'm like, you know what? Hey, for what is worth for okay. what you have contributed, great stuff. Okay, the time, should, I bring, time is, should I bring when the time is, when the should time I bring stats? Should I bring stats? I can right, bring stats, but you, you do want not jump, want to you listen want, to you, stats. You, no, no, no. Okay. You do not. You're, you're jumping listen, down my throat now. You we, do we, not we, want to we... listen to stats when it comes to Trossard's minutes. You do not want to listen to stats when it comes to Eddie and Ketia's away form. Okay? So do not do this. Because I've used stats many times. And this is not only eye test, bro. Whoa, whoa, this is stats. Whoa. Yeah, you can yawn what you want, bro. You're 40 plus a child, bro. What the but, fuck? Hey, listen, lads, 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 hey, listen, listen, listen. What we're gonna day, do? We, listen, what we're not gonna we do is opinions. we're not gonna we're not gonna we're not gonna sit here and take the piss. Yeah, can we just can we just have proper argument right now? Bro, and, look and, at and this I, guy, bro. I, yawning. If I, if I stop with the gunner players. Stop with the gunner players. Stop with the gunner players. That's you, bro. That's you. If I yawn, that's you, bro. That's you, bro. It's the final day. It's the final day of Ramadan. Can you imagine? The final day of Ramadan. I'm yawning. I'm yawning. I want to tell me my age. Like, who's the child? Can I? Can I say oh, something? Child, that's Can I say something? Can I say something? Go ahead. Go ahead, Giuseppe, please. Yeah. Listen, first of all, listen, <laughs> everyone's got opinions. We're going to debate the opinions. Like, the thing is, you've got to let someone die. You do have to let someone finish their opinion. You can't just be speaking over them repeatedly in the same thing. That's not right. Yeah, the same way it's not right. Shout and saying, hey, none of this is right. But at the end of the day, it's because we love Arsenal. We all love Arsenal. We know that. We're all brothers. We're all in the same chat, wherever. We can have this sort of these debates. But what I will say is, you just said that Trossard was underperforming in your eyes, Dale, as well. Yeah. yeah, for me. So that means you're me. putting down a player then? That's the no, same no, no, no. putting saying, down I'm a saying, player. I'm saying, no, no, I didn't, say, I didn't say he's not a good player. I said he's underperforming for what I expect him to do as a centre forward. The stats he has as compared to certain other players in the team who haven't played just as much as he has and who are also midfielders. So, for example, Ikai Havas was bought as a midfielder, right? Agreed. But yeah, we yeah. play him at the center forward. So he does he does either like a false uh, a false uh, second striker role or he plays uh, up front at the center forward. For Trussard and um, and uh, Havertz, both of them this season in total have played, I think, six games each as center forwards. But one has more output in number of goals. Now, I test Trussard looks better. Don't get me wrong. My What I'm saying is for the position that you're playing, your output is underperforming for me. I'm not saying he will not catch up to it or he's not a better player. So when people start using stats like, oh, let's calculate um, somebody else's game when he's away. You want to use away matches data to calculate against somebody else's um, mm. home form. It doesn't work. It's got to be home form for home form, away form for away form. You can want That's all player. it is. You can think okay, of but one thing, yeah. One thing about this, yeah. This guy is the biggest fraud that I've ever listened to because this guy tried the same in the WhatsApp chat, in the group chat, when he said, oh, Trossard almost had the same minutes as, uh, uh, I mean, the Trossard has almost the same games as Havertz. But look at Havertz's stats. Bro, this I guy has 1,500, I, I said, 1,500, oh 1500 less God. minutes. 1,500. Oh, my God. Do you, know, said, do you know mathematics, bro? Do you know what 1,500 means? 
Uh, Why is he do... so heated, bro? What is bro, going on, bro, bro? You know, you know what it is, bro. This guy is doing this on purpose, bro. Because this guy is not doing this because he's actually being objective and trying to speak stats. This is not why he's doing this. Because why would he bring up Trossard in the first place when I roast Eddie and Ketia, bro? Why would he do that? I didn't leave, by the way. He's he's back. He's back. He didn't, <laughs> I, he didn't but because he why? Didn't, no, no, no. Listen. Why would he bring up Trossard when I speak about Eddie and Ketia, who everybody else roasts, by the way, but when I roast players, it's don't put on our players. Don't put on our players. Listen, What's that, bro? I'll, I'll, I'll be real. I'll be real. Eddie and Ketty is trash. And now, <laughs> I'm, I'm just, I'm just, listen, I'm, I'm just speaking. Sorry, Actually, Trussard, you know what? No. Oh, hold on. Hold on. No, no, no. Trossard, Trossard, Trossard has, uh, has, uh, is a new player in this team. Eddie and Ketty has been here for ages, bro. He's dusty, bro. Uh, uh, let me let actually let me go to hooks because he actually had his hand up. So let me go to hooks first, and I'm gonna land my minerals on any Ketia because subpar I just, man. I, I, I just I just need to say something just so the just so the people understand. Yeah, just so the people understand. Yeah, <laughs> my was that? Just, just, just <laughs> that's it. In a family argument, you need to get in there, bro. Because <laughs> the, the, the the people need to understand this. Yeah, Eddie and Ketia is absolutely garbage. And Facts. This brother. Facts should shouldn't even be wearing a number within ten digits to the number fourteen. Let alone how dare you? The number how dare 14. you do that? How dare Let, you do that, bro? How how dare how, how dare, dare you? Enketia think that he can wear the number fourteen? Does he know who's worn that shirt, bro? Like, bro, I'm sorry, yeah. This guy is absolutely <laughs> trash. Yeah, he's. So dead that it's unreal, yeah. I don't care whatever excuse or whatever comparison anyone wants to make to anybody else, bro. This guy is just dead. He's not he's not made for Arsenal, yeah. Big up his mentality. He's got a good hey, stop putting down our players. Stop putting down our players. Stop putting down our players. Hey, this is the realest shit that's ever been spoken in a in a in a chat right now, yeah. The realest. Bro, yeah. Bro, he's not if championship half time level, hooks bro. is saying says an Arsenal player is garbage, they probably aren't championship level. Bro, like, bro, bro like let's be level, let's bro. be let's be just let's just be real. Yeah, let's just be real. Yeah. All of us can remember at least maybe. Mm. Two to three times minimum, where they've been extremely disappointed with Eddie and Ketia and wished that he played for Crystal Palace. Minimum. Yeah. Hmm. The thing is, well, listen, think, listen. Let me, let me, let me, let me just, quick, let me just. Quick, oh, that's let me every game for me. Let me just, let me just quickly go. Let me just quickly go to the super. Can I? Yeah, go to the super chat. Can I? I just want to do the super chat and then and then and then you can rebut all day. Um. Or you can give us your thoughts on, like, you just just try and explain yourself. Nobody interrupt him when Dio starts speaking. Let's just let him try explain himself from what he's. It's not what even he's about. It's say, not but, even about. It's not even about me defending Eddie. Me, I'm saying the question is, Eddie didn't run into Arsenal Football Club, steal the number fourteen jersey, write his name on it, and just join the team and say, "I'm going to stay here." He did. The, cl the club is keeping him there. So, so to sit here and then and say, "Who's paying him?" It's the club to sit here and then want to say. Oh, if that's why it's like the squad for me is never, I will not put down the, the squad. If Edu and Arteta and the management sat there, struck a deal with him, gave him the number 14 jersey. They, no, mm. no, hold on. As far as they were concerned, they thought, and, they, and they, they can get it wrong, they're humans. If they still feel that they're keeping him there, that's stupid on them. Now, Eddie needs to perform on the pitch. Yes, agreed. He needs to perform on the pitch. Every player needs to get on that pitch and play their hearts out. But all I will say is this. You can pick out and say, well, Eddie has not performed very well. In fact, he's not even up to standard for us now. Then why is he still there? Who are the people keeping him there? Who are the people keeping him there? We're not holding those people, we're not holding those people responsible, but we, we just want to pick out Wait, a player can, can, and just can, can trash the player. Hooks, hooks, yes, he's on, trash, on, yes, he's trash on, on, on. Yes, he's trash on. Yes, he's trash on. Super chat. Just, just super okay. chat. Listen, firstly, I just, I just want to shout out um, Phineas. Big up Phineas. Um, for for the uh super chat uh 199 big up to you my brother for supporting the channel i really do appreciate it saying dio needs that uh you needs that waffle cell part two today um listen big up to oh, staffy is, big up to is, american this that, waffle this is that dude from yesterday that decided uh, to pay to put me in jail you spent <laughs> you need to were you, you in waffle cell yesterday i didn't watch waffle cell yesterday yeah, i didn't need to, watch american waffle but you i need, need to go you need to super chat again super chat again I to need put to go me in waffle cell today yeah, yeah, yeah you yeah. have to super chat 50 bucks this time he around said, it, 
Yeah, yeah, if you if you super chat fifty bucks, we'll find a way to put him in a waffle cell. No, you put me in the ba- you put it, me backstage. But... No, no, you put me backstage for five minutes. You super mm. chat fifty bucks, and I'll go backstage for five minutes. Fifty bucks, five minutes. It could happen. It could happen. <laughs> but listen, um, big up to you, my brother. Listen, big up to Staffy. Big up to America Waffle, one of the greatest shows, man. I love seeing my American peeps, man, over there, man. Yeah, so real, big up man. to you guys. But anyway, um. Man's go ahead. So let's so let I just there let you just, are. Hooks, there you hooks, are. Hooks, hooks before you man. hooks before you respond. Let me just finish what I was saying. The people that that are keeping him there are the people that are hold responsible. But here's what I would say about Ateta as a manager and the club men, or the club structure. When Ateta kept Granny Shaka, I did not want him to stay. I didn't want him to stay, but I saw what he did with him. When Ateta bought uh Havert, I was like, what is this guy doing? But I've seen what he's done with him. The mm. player that Ateta has bought, Jorginho, like you're buying Jorginho from Chelsea of all the people. City's buying Kovacic, you're getting Jorginho, but I've seen what he's done with him. Whatever it is that Ateta thinks that Eddie does for that team, I trust Ateta in the fact that right now as we are speaking, we are number we're, we're top of the league, whether it's by goals difference or whatever it is, we're in the quarterfinals of the Champions League with this same squad. So my opinion of the players is, the gaffer thinks they can do it, or he knows what role that they're playing. Whether it is to come in and run around headless like a headless chicken, if that is why you've kept him there because he now has thicker thighs and more chunky muscles to run around, all well and good, as long as we win. And then when you feel it's time to sell him, sell him. You know best. My thing is, don't come and give me an excuse at the end of the season, Ateta, and say, oh, I had Eddie, that's why I could not win. I don't want to hear that because you've kept him there. That's the reason I said when it comes to the players and it comes to the squad, I don't put them down if the, if the, if the management decides to keep them. Eddie is full profit if we sell him. We can get somebody else. That's all I'm saying. So when, when I'm talking mm-hmm, about But like when Eddie, it came to Ramsdale, when you I'm, put him down. When, when it came to never, ESR, Ramsdale you put down? him down. But when it comes down? to Eddie and Ketia, when, I, when I speak, when when I speak I about a player, you suddenly disagree with it. I've never that's put you, down bro. Ramsdale. No, no, no. That's you. Ramsdale. You I've put Ramsdale down. down. You put down. ESR down. That's you. That. you are lying. that is you. You are lying out of your teeth. I have never so, put down Ramsdale. Is the, am I, have I have right or am I wrong? When we were doing I sell, keep, and loan, what did these guys say for Ramsdale? What, what did what, these guys say, bro? What did I say? I said keep Ramsdale. Everybody said You waved. Together with this guy, you waved, bro. What did I say? I said, keep Ramsdale. I thought I'd rather have Ramsdale as a number two. Do you remember? I said, I'd rather have Ramsdale as a number two because even though, I said, even though he doesn't have distribution, I said, I said keep party. I said, keep Ramsdale. ESR, I said, keep Ramsdale. No, you, you, no, you're a hypocrite, bro. You are a hypocrite, bro. You are a hypocrite. You, 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 you only pick and choose. Uh, you pick and choose. Listen, you pick and choose, bro. Listen, you pick and choose. It was me and Dio. It was actually, it was actually me and Dio. I said keep Ramsdale. I said keep Ramsdale. Keep Ramsdale. The video is here. If he's you happy like to do it, you like me to do it. When there's a okay. video, but, evidence of it. But Jesus regardless. Christ, man. Regardless, let's talk about the man. Not, yes, not only exactly. Ramsdale, not only Ramsdale. I've named other I players as well. Okay, I've named other players as well. Hey, listen, you don't have to lie. You can just make a this, point without lying. This conversation, this conversation is mad. Listen, yeah, let's mad go back. To, let's go back. Let's go back. Hold yes, on, hold and on, and it hold started let's, because let's, this guy on, wanted on. to protect Nketiah. That's all I'm saying. That's fine. Protect Nketiah. Do whatever you want. He talks just for the sake of talking. That's tea, it. Tea or lie. Safi. And you hide your face because you yeah, like to lie. Yeah, Safi. I'm not going to grow with the Lebanon. No, unlike you, I have a legit, legitimate job, bro. That's why I do not show my face that easily. You know what I'm saying? Oh and I don't, man. right? I don't have a legitimate guys, job. So, guys, so don't do this. Guys, don't do this. If you want to do this, if you want to make this personal, relax. I can make this personal, bro. Guys, guys, guys. Yeah. We're not going to do personal yeah. things. Yeah, we're, not we're not doing personal digs, bro. Yeah, man. What is well, like, we're not doing personal yeah, digs, bro. It's just heated. Bro. It's just heated, yeah, man. Well, like, bro, like, yeah, man. Well, like, like, bro. Like, let's, let's, just, let's just relax. Yeah, relax. Bro, how do, we start, how do we start from, from Inketia? And <laughs> what is Inketia and doing to our fan base, bro? And trust her, bro. Look at Inketia. Inketia, bro. Look what you're doing to my fan base, bro. Look what you're doing to my fan base. Look, I got this small little USB, bro. Well, like, look what you're doing, bro. Well, I, anyway, listen, I'm going to bring you guys back. We're, we're going to speak about the game. I don't want to hear nothing about Nketiah. I don't want to hear nothing about Trossard. I don't want to hear about nothing. I just want to hear about the, um, I want to hear about the game. I want to hear about score predictions. What 
you think the score prediction will be for today? Um, now you've seen the lineup. Your thoughts on Martinelli starting? Because <clears throat> I want to get everybody's thoughts. I'm bringing these guys back. Uh, okay, uh, T just left, but um, yeah. Listen, I want to get I want to get your thoughts, your feelings um, on Martinelli starting a left wing. Let me know. T's back now. I want to get your thoughts. I want to get your feelings on Martinelli starting a left wing. Me, I, I for one, I'm, I'm so happy um, because I finally get to see this guy lacing his boots uh, on the left wing where he deserves to play. Not on some dusty right wing role that Arteta is trying to do. That's not him. That's not Martinelli. I like to yeah, see him I on the left that. wing. He's on the left wing. And we finally get to see him coming up against, <clears throat> you know, whoever's on the right side. Do you know what I mean? I'm, I'm excited, man. What are you guys' thoughts on it? I think on, uh, on Martinelli. Oh, Martinelli. So not score predictions yet. Nah. Do you want my score prediction now? Well, yeah. Let's just speak about Martinelli. We've got score uh, yeah. predictions. Just no, yeah. Go, what you said about that dusty right side, that dusty right. Mm. Hey, listen, I've hated Martinelli on the right side. <laughs> Every day, he does not look comfortable at all. Like he seems like it's weird because it's, it's weird how you see some players like Saka can go either side and it kind of just works. Like with Martinelli, it seems like it's weird. You think if you can do one wing, you can do the other wing. But I think he might be overthinking it a bit too much trying to mm. get into the game and being on that side. But he does not look comfortable on the right. So him being back on the left today, he should be hungry, man. He should be hungry. And listen, like, that's probably their weaker their weaker side of the, the team. Martinelli side, because you've got Kimmich, um, not that good lad, that will be inverting him probably. And then there's Dyer on that side. So it's probably going to be the one that we can get at a bit more. So I'm happy with uh, Martinelli, man. Raw, I hope you're wrong, mate. I really hope you're wrong, mate. If you if if this guy plans, to, if Arteta plans, I'm not even gonna call him this guy. Nah. Respect for Arteta. Arteta plans to do that. That's crazy. But um, Never. yeah, big up to Raw. Um, anybody else want to speak about Martinelli before we go to? I think, I think Arteta. I think Arteta had only played him on the right just to to fill time when we're leading in those games so that Saka could rest. I didn't want to bring in a Nelson or anybody else because he just felt he needed minutes. And instead of like just changing the whole formation back and saying, okay, um, Martinelli go to the left and maybe he's used to the right side, you know, just go play right wing, hold the ball down. We're not trying to score anymore. Get some minutes in your legs, you know, so that that way you can prep yourself from the injury. And let's see what happens when you play against, when we go against the uh, uh, Bayern. So I think that's what he just did. I don't think he's planning to ever play him on the right. Because in those two games, he played like, what, 10, 15 minutes on the right? In those two games mm -hmm. where they played him on the right, it was just like, come in, fill time, and then boom. You know, so so I don't think he's going to play him on the right for this game. I think it's uh, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't long stints. I think when he was playing it on the right, it was probably for the last 10 15 minutes. 10, 15 of the game. Minutes, yeah. I think it was 10 15 minutes in like two games. I think he just wanted him to get mm. more minutes in his legs and just said, Hey, look, just go in there, stay on the right, just replace Bukayo Saka. We have 15 minutes, we're leading 2 0, we're leading 3 0 against the bright, you know, that kind of thing. Like, just go in there and just burn time, mm. get some minutes yeah. in your leg. Don't don't go to your left wing where you're comfortable and you try and drive at people and get injured again. Just go get some minutes in your leg and let's just keep keep up the pace. And that's it. I think that's what he just did. Hmm. Now, fair enough. T, what are, you, what are your thoughts on Martinelli, man? Returning back to the squad on the left um, after a, a spell out due mm -hmm. to the, um, the severe cut on his foot. What are your thoughts? Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts on him playing on the left and obviously in that front line again? Mm -hmm. so um, well, I will talk carefully before I criticize and cannot criticize a player, you know what I'm saying? But, um, I gave him one chance, I gave Martinelli is uh, no, 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 I'm moving on. This, uh, uh, I wanted Martinelli to play, uh, because I think he was fit enough for the last few games, um, because we uh, um, knew and it was already uh, um, kind of reported. Not reported uh, straight from Arsenal, but we already know that it, was, it wasn't a big injury. It was mostly a cut that we didn't want to open up again. So um, it, wasn't, it wasn't anything major. But uh, when I saw him the last few games, I was like, okay, this guy is 100% fit enough to play. I just wanted him to start at the 11. 
I didn't know it would be Bayern Munchen. <laughs> That it would be the first game that he would start uh, at the first eleven again. You know what I'm saying? I would expect it to him to play at Brighton as well. But um, yeah, I'm happy that he's playing uh, because this was the front line that I wanted to go with. I told you we need pace. Uh, we need a lot of pace, especially because they're playing Kimmich. We can expose his um, lack of pace, uh, lack of uh, uh, how should I say? It, it will be hard for him to keep up with Martinelli. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. So, um, yeah, it, 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 I'm happy with Martinelli. I'm happy that he's fit again. Uh, let's just hope that nothing else will happen this game to our other players, apart from Eddie and Ketia. Um, but yeah, uh, uh, let's let's. Uh, th th that's that's all it. That's all, uh, all, yeah. all I got to say about it, really. No, fair enough, fair enough. And they're just literally on my TV. They're just showing the. Uh... They're just showing the away end with a hella Arsenal man in there. <laughs> I can't lie. Looks cold. It looks cold. But Can now I we're going to have, if we, if uh, now we're going to have, even if we beat them, it's going to be, oh yeah, but it's because they had no fans and, you know, our rivals well, are going to start. I don't man. care what anybody <laughs> says. If we beat them by a good score, I'm shameless. But mm. let's get to that when we get to that. What is mm -hmm. what, I, I, what are your score predictions? Well, I don't think we hooks. Well, yeah, I don't no, no. think we hooks. No, 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 but the kickoff's at eight. Kickoff's at eight, innit? I just have a, I just have a, I just have a, I just have a question, and it's a, and it's a simple question. Yeah, it's a, it's a yes or no question, innit? For hmm. all the man, yeah, for all the man, yeah, because as far as I can tell, it's all of you, yeah. For all the man, yeah, that insinuate or imply that I'm toxic positive, yeah, because I think that we can punch up Bayern, yeah. If we punch up Bayern. Are you, man, going to say, oh, man, yeah, we punched up Bayern. Well, it's because oh, Bayern are not that great right now. And, oh, they've got bad form. And, oh, they're not doing that well. No. No, if we no. punch up Bayern, we punch up Bayern. Bayern. My thing is that you, you – I, I think that it's – I think that it, it's clutching to say we're going to smash them. And, of course, if we do, then you can sit there and say, I knew, I knew. But like, I, I think if you logically look at it, you can't see us smashing them, bruv. Because you but that's not the question. Up. That's not the question that mm -hmm. I asked. That's not the question. So if we smash them, we smash we deserve to smash them because I don't think we'll smash yeah. them. If we do you know what it is, hooks. Even, you know what it is hooks? Full, even with all the form and everything, sorry, sorry, T. Just with all no, the no, form no, and everything, the way their form is, I still don't expect to smash them. Sad to, yeah. to speed up a little bit. My score prediction is 2 1 to Arsenal. Yeah, I was thinking yeah. 2 0, but I'm looking at this team now. I think Harry Kane, that bastard, they'll get a goal. Like mm -hmm. yeah. So for no. me, uh, yeah. yeah. I won't come here and start going, yeah, but we only smashed them because they're poor on form and that, because I don't think we should be smashing them, even on all this stuff that everyone's saying. So I'll give them flowers and credit if we do smash them. Yeah, for me, it's not about showing chest, okay? Because you can show, show chest. You have every right to show chest hooks. I'm not taking that away from you. I would never. You know what I'm saying? If you think about something a certain way, I wouldn't tell you you're wrong. I would never do that. You know what I'm saying? Because that's your opinion at the end of the day. Okay? But what you do, <laughs> in comparison to other people that show chest, we can show chest. Bro, you show Pamela Anderson chest. That's the difference. You know what I'm saying? You want us to go straight up Pamela Anderson, bro. Yeah, but it's not a car, bro. It's got to be there, man. Do you know what I mean, man? <laughs> French press chest, you get me? It's what it's got to be, bro, man. It can't be no little deflated chest, bro. You know what I mean, man? No, but for, for example, I said 3-1. I think 3-1 is showing chest. Because oh. beating Bayern München at home 3-1 is, in my opinion, a big accomplishment. You know what I'm saying? Especially if, if you haven't played for in the Champions League for a long, long time. You are uh, playing one of the top four, top five sides of this uh, 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 competition as a whole, you know what I'm saying? And if you beat them 3 1, that's a big accomplishment for me, and that's showing chest, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and I hear it, I hear it, I hear it, I hear it. So essentially, I said 2 0, 3 0. So essentially, we got the same same sort of feeling on the game. I just think that we'll keep the clean sheet, whereas you think we'll concede. I hear that, I hear that, I hear that, I hear that, I hear that. I hear that. Yeah, anyone I think it will be a game? smashing. Based I don't think the... it'll be a smashing game though. Like, like you know, like you can have a two 0 that is a paced in, like where you're just all over them, bare easy, and then you can have a two, like a two one where it's like a bit more of a game. Bro. Like, I think it's going to be a good game. 
like a proper game like both teams and two one Arsenal. Eddie and Ketty had to get the winner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, you know, Bayern Mission is a weird. You know, imagine side, the thing of, I imagine, hey, bro, like that's me, yeah, yeah, we, we can make jokes about it now. Like, let's all laugh, bro. Mm-hmm. bro. Imagine Dio after fucking Eddie and Ketty come on and got the winner today, <laughs> two one, bro. <laughs> hey, all, I all I'm, I all I'm saying is, if, if that happens, if that I happens, I will delete my account and never join the panel again. <laughs> All, all I all I want is a win, man. I don't care. Yeah. Like my my point no. is like my point is use the squad as this is what we have till the end of the season. We don't have an option. We can't so what's your score it. prediction? I'm like my score prediction is two zero. I think I think we can still keep a clean sheet at the Emirates. I think we can hold them up to a two goal lead. Um, and take that to the Alliance Arena. That place is a is a hellhole to go and play in. That's what I know. You know. So I'd rather go there with a clean sheet than having them score at our end. I, I hope they don't score. I know Harry Kane likes to score against us, but I just hope mm. that they're not able to score against us at the Emirates. That will give us a big boost. And mm-hmm. um, if we're going to go by precedent, if we're going to go by precedent, we haven't conceded a goal in the Champions League at home at the Emirates throughout the, you know... The, I think I as mean, well that but, but they, there is a reason. Fans, their fans are going to be well up for it at their stadium as well. We've got to remember that because they ain't getting mm-hmm. this on. So they're going to be extra loud when we go there. Yeah, mm-hmm. they will be. There will be and, and, and Dale, there is a reason why I say we will concede because I have a superstition. It's one of my things in at the stream. You know what I'm saying? Because every time I say we concede, <laughs> we get clean sheets. So that's it's why true. I say it's gonna be a three-one. It's true. Oh yeah, yeah no, I, I I hear I know I know you say that all the time. And every time you've you've predicted um us conceding, it's always been a clean sheet. I just I just fingers crossed two zero is what I'm saying. Like we're both saying literally, like your your superstition comes true, we, we keep a clean sheet. My wish comes through. We keep a clean sheet. I just, I would, that clean sheet is big for me because it's Bayern. And when we go over there, like it's going to be hard. But when, if we do it and we keep a clean sheet because because of our defense, I think if we lean on our defense, um, we have Martinelli with pace who can, you know, getting behind them, mm-hmm. get the ball back in, you know, have us doing this thing, creating space. But we're talking Bayern here. So my thing is we just do the best we can to keep a clean sheet, 2-0 if we can. Mm-hmm. Uh, take that 2-0 lead to, to the you know arena and let's see what happens when we go. You, you, you know what, Dale? Truth. I am sorry for what I said today. And excuse me for my uh, 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 temperament against you. But I hope just for you that Eddie and Ketia will play today. I don't know. I don't care. I've told you already. I don't care who plays. Look, look, uh, hold that. If, let me tell you this. I no, don't care. Kidding. I know. I don't care who plays. That's my own thing. Like, if we want to play only Trossard in the middle of the pitch and nobody else, and Trossard can score two against Bayern, please go ahead. Look, if Arteta feels hey, that even then he would score, bro. And that's that's what I'm saying. Like, if I, look, see, if Arteta feels that the kids man is the guy that should get on the pitch and the guy can score two goals, please do. At this stage of the game, I don't even want to. I don't want to tactically think about anything or stress. I'm just like, look, just go in there and win. That's my thing. Just go in there and win. However you want to do it. If you want to bring in somebody three minutes to the end of the game and that's the super sub, do it. If it is going to be some random uh, player from the academy that is on the list that we that was not mentioned earlier, <laughs> that, that shows off the score, I don't care. My thing is. At this stage, you, you've done well. You've gotten us this far. Just try to go. Just try to go the long haul. If you've come mm-hmm. this far, just try. Yeah, just try to go the long haul. That's that's where I'm at with this. And, you know. So. And, I, and I and I hear that. And want to and I want to clarify something at the chat. It's all good. Okay. Do not cuss me because I don't show my face. Because it's normal. You know I've seen your face. I've seen your face. Now, why will you be mad at that? I've seen you. I know you are a real person. I know you are not an avatar on AI. I know now. Yes. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just clarifying one thing to the chat because I saw a few people cussing me. Fuck you, Phineas, but hold that. But anyway. Oh, no, no, um, Phineas, Phineas, no, no, Phineas is a But these man. guys ain't got no face either. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Come to a panel and talk. You know what I'm saying? TK, let me do this for you. Hold on. Let me do this for you. Phineas, you're douchebag. The only person allowed to insult TK is me and TK insulting ourselves. You don't come here. You're not one of us. Unless you supercharge 50 bucks, like I told you, then you'll put me five minutes jail. If you can't do it, don't come here with your one dollar ninety nine that you did yesterday and put me in waffle jail. So you have I've marked you Phineas four two one. You don't even have your real name four two one. I'm sure that four two one is the is the area code of your of your neighborhood where you guys do all sorts of dodgy things. Look at him. I, I just want to say. I just want to anyway. say. I just want to say. I love all the people. There you are in the in the in the. Phineas, I'm messing with uh, you. I love all the people in the chat and. <laughs> 
And if you guys, you know, all of you guys in the chat want to just, you know, super chat hard, like $99 every stream. Yeah. So he starts realizing that he has to pay me. Yeah. I would just, I would love that. That would just be so beautiful. So uh, think of it like this. If you support, One, huh? if you support, yeah, Sarge yes. Channel, indirectly you're supporting me, the greatest guy in the world. So let's get it going. Yeah, let's do this. Let's this, this, this guy. I thought Habits was the greatest guy in the world, bro. Make up let's your move. mind. And like, look. Hey, bro, we got three minutes to this game, so I'm not going to lie. I've got to go. you got to go. Yeah, yeah. Phineas, yeah, I, I know you do. I know. I'm gonna, no, Phineas, to... Phineas, I'm messing with you, you're man. Making me, you're making you. me miss the Champions League anthem. I'm just messing with you. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, yeah. listen, guys. Um, big up to you guys. Um, make sure, make sure to um Legal come head, through yeah. for the half time. Yeah. Head, yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. 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 yeah cool, cool. No worries. All right. Big up, lads. Big up. Big up. Big, uh, big up. up big ciao, up. ciao. Laters, 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 laters. Right, guys and girls. Ladies and gentlemen, we're plugging.
Right. Uh, we're back, guys. We're back. Um, yeah, I can't lie. My whole system just uh, went crazy there. My bad. My bad, guys. Look at T. T was here ready, bro. T was here ready. <laughs> oh, mate. My bad, guys. Um, let me just uh, get this started. There we go. There we go. All good, T. All good. I'm all good. I'm back. I'm back now. I'm back. Cheers, man. My bad, people. Uh, my computer just literally caved in on itself. Um, but yeah, listen, make sure you're smashing that like button for me, please. Uh, while we fix these, these technical difficulties, uh, make sure to get that all sorted for us, please. Um, let me just get myself sorted here. Yeah. Sorry about that guys. Um, I'm just about to Ben White going forward and it's out. City are one nil up already, apparently. So City are up already, one nil. And we are here. Watching the Arsenal game. Hey, listen, I'm here for it, man. I'm here for it. Here we go. Leroy Sane against Ben White, I think that. No, against Kivio, sorry. Look at Declan Rice. Declan Rice. Oh, my God. Musiala. Over to Anthony Dav Alfonso Davies. Sorry, Anthony Davis. This ain't basketball. Musiala. Oh, Jorginho, watch out, man. Be careful. Limer. Dyer, Delict. I can't believe Man City have already scored. It's crazy. That's crazy. Oh, and goes towards Musiala. Bayern have started strong so far. Here we go. Let's see what's going to happen here, man. Look at Havertz, man. That's it. Come on, man. Brilliant. Out for a throw in. We'll take that. They're just showing me the goal for Real Madrid. So I actually get to see it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Keeper has got to be doing better there, man. Here we go. Erdegaard pressing. Come on, guys. Press, 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 press. Come on. Okay, Saliba on the ball. Let's see what he can do. Come on. Erdegaard over to Saka. Let's see Saka take him on. Does not. Ben White. Musiala goes straight into Ben White and he goes out for a throw in. Out for another throw in. Oh, in towards Habits. Flick back into the box. Oh, unlucky. Flag up for offside. Flag up offside. Bernabas quiet as F. City silence these men. 
listen, I wouldn't listen. One nil is 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 nothing. Oh my God, Saka over to Havertz. Oh my God, Nelly, Nelly! Oh, just wide from Martinelli. Just wide from Martinelli. Oh wow, brilliant from Saka to get the ball back and Havertz with the hold up, and then from Odegaard over to Martinelli and just wide, just wide of the post. Come on, unlucky. Unlucky, mate. With his left foot. Kivio. Saliba. Ben White. Saka fouled. It's a foul, mate. Erdegaard puts the ball over the top. Tries to get to Ben White. Too much on it. Too much on it. Eric Dyer on the ball. Taking a goal kick. Gets booed every single time. Noya. Noya. Oh. Eric Dyer nearly caught there. Ben White. Saka. Fouled. And that's another foul. And that is a yellow card for Alfonso Davies. That's brilliant. Now Alfonso Davies got a yellow card. We target that side. Target that right side. And he misses the next game, guys. Alfonso Davies mi misses the next game. Alfonso Davies misses the next game, guys. It's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. We'll take it. What we need. Tinny at the back. Gabby in attack. Arsenal away. Win the league. We've got Super Mikateta. Right, who's going to take this free kick? Who's going to take this free kick? It looks like it's Declan Rice. About to take it. Takes it short. Odegaard. Saka. Saka back to Odegaard. Rice, Ben White, puts the ball over to Martinelli, I think the ball went out there, it has now, I thought the ball went out there, but there we go. Noya kicks it out. Long. Kivio. Back to Raya. Gabriel. You'll always be shit, Eric Dyer. You'll always be shit. Come on, Saliba. Martin Odegaard. We've got to be going down this right side. We've got to be going down that left side. Yeah? Gabriel. Odegaard. Come on now. Get in this right side. Look at Ben White. Oh, the run. You have to look at... Bro, you have to look at the run. Oh, look at Saka. Oh, look at Saka. And now it's Havertz. Saka. Saka! Walla! Mbappe! 
Ray Osaka! With an Iron Robin-esque shot into the bottom left corner. And that's how you do it, my son. That is how you do it, my son. Bukayo Saka with an absolute scream out to the bottom left corner. And this stadium absolutely erupts. Wow. Is he offside? Is he going to be offside? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And these men told me my star boy can't be chatted to. They can't, they try to chat to my star boy. The real star boy, original star boy up in this piece. However disrespect. However disrespect. You pussios. Look at that, man. Come on. Let's go. And that is 1 0 to Arsenal. Let's go, man. Let's get this. Let's push on from this now. Let's push on from this. 1 0 to the Arsenal. 1 0 to the Arsenal. 1 0 to the Arsenal. 1 0. Limer. Real 1 1. Kamavinga. Brilliant. Limer. Dyer. Here we go, guys. Noya. Eric Dyer. Get off the ball, you scumbag, bro. You... Bro, this guy's a dirtbag, bro. Daddy, oh. Eric Dyer just looks nervous. He just looks nervous. It's mad. It's actually mad. Kivio over to Martinelli. Gabriel. Saliba. Erdegaard. <clears throat> Gabriel, Martin Odegaard, come on. <laughs> Zane said, of course, the, of course Dye is nervous to say it is level. <laughs> hey, it's crazy. Allah, Real, 2-1. See, you can't count your chickens yet, man. Saliba, Saka, back to Saliba, and then back to Gabriel. Jorginho. Look at Havertz making space, bro. Come on. Jorginho. Come on, people. Oh, Ben White making a run. Ben White! Oh, my God, Ben White! You had to go for a corner, bro. Not straight at the keeper. Not straight at the keeper, Ben. Oh, mate. Gabriel. Kivio. Throw in for Arsenal. Come on. Oh my goodness. Look at these goals for Real Madrid. Let me see this. So Kamavinga. Oh my god. No way did he score from there. Oh, deflection. Deflection. But what a goal. And let me see this Rodrigo. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, Rodrigo's scoring that, bro. Rodrigo's scoring that. <laughs> hey, that's a crazy goal to concede from Rodrigo, bro. 
That is a crazy goal. Gabriel. Here we go. Erdegaard. Over to Jorginho. Havertz picks it up and gets it over to Kivio. Kivio. Over to Martinelli. Nelly. 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 Kivio. Havertz. Jorginho. Erdegaard. Gets it to Saka. Just too much on the pass, but it's all good. Ben White. Erdegaard to Saka. Tries to give it back to Erdegaard, but can't. And Musiala just gets it out. Ah, oh, don't give away possession like that, mate. Goretzka! Gnabry scores. Gnabry scores and he celebrates, you pussy -o. Say less. Say less. And you celebrate as well, yeah? Say less. Big mistake from us. Big mistake from us. Absolutely big mistake from us. Absolutely bullshit, bro. Absolute bullshit, bro. Absolute bullshit, bro. Oh, Saka. Declan Rice, come on. Puts a cross into the middle. Out of God. Martinelli. Come on, lads. Let's put the pressure on, man. Such a shitty goal to concede. Kivio. Martinelli. I don't know why Raya is so far forward, bro. Saka. Fouled. Musiala fouls him. It's such a shitty goal to concede. It's such a shitty goal to concede. Such a shitty goal to concede. Declan Rice. Not a handball. Declan Rice. Puts the ball over to that Martinelli. Nelly. Gabriel. Back to Nelly. Nelly puts a cross in. Oh, Kivio in the middle.
Foul. Gabriel gets fouled by Harry Kane. <clears throat> Come on. Jorginho. Jorginho. Ah, oh, it's unlucky that. Oh, look at Saka getting the ball back. Oh, the God. Ben White. That's going to be a throw in. That's an Arsenal throw. Come on, let's go. Back. Another Arsenal throw. Come on, let's go. Oh, the God. Oh, Kivio, you just can't. You really can't stretch like that and just miss it. Like, just calm down, my friend. Gabriel. Saliba. Saka. Martinelli. Oh, dispossessed. Pass back to Noya. Here we go. Come on, don't let Alfonso Davies do that. Don't let him get past you like that, man. Like, look at how quickly Bayern Munich can hurt you. It's, it's, it's so easy. Now, all good, Serena. Big up to you. Big up to you, Serena. Harry Kane. The ball over the top. Musiala, I think, was running onto it, but couldn't get onto it. Ben White, back to Jorginho. Oh, here we go. Saka. Saka. Out for a corner. Gnabry ran back for that one. Pussy. Or. Fuck Serge Gnabry, man. Let's see. Corner. First corner of the game. Corner taken. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, it was a loose ball in the box. Oh, Ben White and Kivio are just trying to. Bro, come on, man. Yeah, Mo, I did, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I did, bro. I can't even eat right now, man. I'm too nervous. All right. 
Oh my god, don't let King thank you. Thank you. Erdegaard. Declan Rice. Erdegaard. Erdegaard running forward. It's, oh, tries to get Saka, but Gnabry is there, bro. Oh, Sane running there. Come on, man. <clears throat> Yeah, listen, man, we need to take our chances. And Ben White not taking that chance. Come on, man. Gabriel. Here we go. Saliba. Erdegaard. Back to Gabriel. Come on, lads. Let's not do the stagnant stuff, man. Erdegaard. Oh, my God, man. Come on, man. Oh, look at Saliba. Look at Saliba. Can Havertz get onto that? Oh, ref, it's not a foul! Whoa. Whoa. Da -da 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 -da. Saliba. Oh my goodness, Kivio. Oh my goodness, Kivio. That's a pen. Saliba, what the fudge have you just done? Saliba, what have you just done? It's a hundred percent penalty. That's a hundred percent a penalty. It's a hundred percent a penalty. I don't know what's happened to us mentally, but bro. Oh my god. Oh my god. And when people tell me inexperience doesn't mean nothing, when people tell me that we're gonna smack these guys, when people say this and people say that. This is what I'm talking about, an experience, bro, in these high levels. Harry Kane, here we go. Harry Kane gets his penalty. Every time this guy comes to our damn thing, bro, every time this guy comes out to our place, bro, this is what happens. Penalty. Get Kivio off. Wanker, Harry Kane. Wanker. You wanker. Of course he's going to score, bro. Of course he's going to score. Of course he's going to score, bro. It's Harry Kane. Oh, so stupid, bro. This is so stupid, bro. It's crazy, man. So stupid, bro. Absolutely horrific. That is stupid.
This is mentality, bro. This is mentality. Mentality, that's what we're losing right now. Experience. Buy and have experience. It's simple as that. It's just as simple as that. Saliba has, uh, Saliba has done something really mad there, bro. Serious. Serious, Saliba. Here we go. Gabriel, come on, boys. Can't believe we've let them have two goals like that, bro. Can't we believe we've let them have two goals? So easy. So simple. Oh, fuck off, Ziad. Well, like, bro. Fuck off, man. Please. But I know people on my fan base are naive. I know people don't understand what it means to play in the Champions League. I know this is going to be difficult. So I knew we had to be at our top, 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 top. We had to be at our best. Bullshit, man. Absolute bullshit. Saka, unlucky. Ben White, Saka, Erdogan. Oh, brother, the pass was there, man. That's a foul. Havertz. Oh, Saka. Almost, man. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Ben White! Oh, wow. Benny Blanco, you absolute legend. Ben White. Oh, you brilliant. You're brilliant, lad. Wow. Look at this. Look at this. Nobody running back. Look at this. Nobody running back. Oh, my God. You couldn't write this. You could not write this. Look at this. As soon as they get the pass back, Bro, you lot sprint back. I don't care if you don't want to stay there because you think you want to score a goal. This, that, ha, ha, ha. Like, bro, sprint back, bro. Who are like these guys, man? I don't know what's happened to this team in this game, especially. Calm down. Just cool it down. Relax. Here we go. Gabriel! Wide. Now get back to the defense, please. Wow. Wow.
Laimer. Gretzka. Gretzka. Kane. Really, mate. Really. Oh, my God, man. And there is a reason. There's a reason why people don't just take it. Hassam sitting there telling me, have some chess. The Bayern are trash. No, it doesn't matter if they're trash. Nothing happens, bro. Musiala. Jorginho to Rice. Rice. Over to Nelly. Nelly. Here we go. Rice. Kivio tries to get to Nelly. Gets it to Nelly, but Goretzka gets it. Kimmich. Harry Kane. Wow. Come on, guys. We just need to press. Press them because at the back, they're nervous. Look, you see, you press them and they make a mistake. It's just that simple. Oh, Erdogan almost there, man. Here we go. Literally, all they have to do is press these guys. Press these guys and they start to fumble. Saka. Gabriel. Kivio. Gabriel. Ben White. Saliba. Saka. Yeah, just that's it, Saliba. That's it, please. He, uh, Saliba has to make up for that one now. Saliba has to make up for that. I'll be so real. He has to because that was a very... Bro. Honestly, man. We've got a lot of hard work to do now. A lot. Because we are 2-1 down. And... Yeah, listen, it's it's not looking good right now. We have a we have to make it. We have to do a miracle right now in order to come back from this, because this is the home leg. Forget about when we're away. Forget about when we're in the Allianz, bro. The Allianz is ten times what what this is gonna be. Look at Odegaard, bang! There we go. There's the run. Goes out for a throw in. Get the throw in done. Come on. Look at Odegaard. Corner. Odegaard has been good. Saka has been good. Declan Rice. But we need to, we need to, we need to work on taking chances and making stuff count, man. Because, and we need to calm down. We need to calm down. Saka with the corner. Oh, my God. Here we go. Jocelyn here with a, <laughs> with a shout out to win the dog. 
Jocelyn, you really love this Winder dog, yeah? Is that what's going on? What's, what's, what is it with you and Winder dog? Big up to you, though. Yeah, Odegaard has definitely been good, Mo. Um, Saka's been good. Declan Rice has been good. Um, I think Gabriel, to a certain extent, has done done all right. But listen, he was involved in that first goal. So Ben White has been amazing. Havertz. Yeah, yeah, big up P, man. Big up P. Guys, go subscribe to Box Boxing Corner Casuals, man. Make sure to go subscribe to my broski, man. He does all boxing content. If you're into boxing, go and subscribe to him, man. It's not off. It's not off, Ref. Fuck off, man. Yeah, go subscribe to him, man. He gets on boxes. You know what I mean? He he he, he does interviews, all of that good stuff. So make sure to go over there and give him a subscription, guys. Well, yeah, fast and done now, bro. And yeah, Ben White is playing very good. Saliba. Saka. Gabriel, come on. Boxing fan and Fulham fan. Kiss my team. <laughs> yeah. Fulham are vexing you. They must be vexing you, bro. You don't know what Fulham you're going to get nowadays, bro. One one week, they're doing a madness. The next week, they're, they're uh, looking rather fragile, bro. So it's crazy, man. Uh, come on, guys. Come on. Martin said fucking Kim Kardashian is a jinx. I'm dead. Is Kim Kardashian here tonight? I hope she's not. Harry Kane. Fouled. One nil. Um, one nil. One minute extra time. One minute of additional time, guys. Ugh. Get Kivior off, man. Get apps. Get this Kivior guy off now. Get Kivior off. He's been rolled uh, like three times this this half alone, man. Bro, get Kivio off, man. Good press from Havertz. Ben White to Saka. Havertz, is he offside? Ben White, ah, oh, it's offside. He goes up late. And that is half time. Half time. Wow. Wow. My oh my, do we have some things to speak about, man? My oh my, do we have some things to speak about? Right. My oh my, do we have some things to speak about? I'll tell you that right now. Firstly, firstly, speaking about um, speaking about the the first half started well. Yeah, we started on the up. We started pressing well. We were doing our thing. Saka scores the goal. We're full of confidence, absolutely full of confidence. The team 
looking like they're they're ready to, to to gun these man down. They actually looked like they were ready to gun these man down. Then the first mistake is then the, the goal is scored. Then we get ball gets passed back. A madness happens. Yeah. And somehow that like I said before, yeah, it's easy. It's very easy to make a simple mistake. And a simple mistake is so costly in this part of the game. At this level, a simple mistake, a simple mistake is so costly. Mm -hmm. So it's just that simple. These guys out there are legit playing like they're shook. Who? They're playing like they're shook. Who? I'm not going to have that. Who's playing like they're shook? Our boys. <laughs> well, to be fair, Kivior didn't look great. Uh, the defensive side, they look a little bit shook. Saliba gave away a penalty. I, I don't know, you know. Well, hold on. I, does does, does I, Hooks I disagree? Know. What do you think yeah, of that first I, half, I, mate? 100%, man. I think, I think we actually played you know, pretty well in the first half, you know, we, the mistake from, um, Gabriel, you know, led to the first goal, you know, it's, it's a mistake, you know, mistakes happen. Kibio. And, and no, it's not Kibio because Gabriel could have passed back to, he could have just passed the ball back towards Raya, even though Raya was, actually, Raya, Raya was actually, next actually, to him. Though. Actually, Gabriel should have left the ball to Raya because Raya came out to claim the ball. So because Gabriel got in the way and took the ball, that left Raya in a bad position. So the mistake is on Gabriel. Like, and then on top of that, Raya saw that Gabriel got to the ball. So he started to track back. So it would have actually been safer for him to knock the ball back towards the goal for Raya to deal with. Raya could have just clotted it with his left foot out into the stands or whatever. So, you know what I mean? So it's Gabriel's mistake. He decided, I'm going to, you know, try and be smart and pass it into Kirio. The ball didn't actually go to Kirio. Kirio tried to stretch out to get it. Couldn't get it. Kirio... In general, Kirio has been poor in this, but like I swear he he got skinned by Sane. Well, getting skinned by Sane is not like it, it happens in it. But I guess if I'm looking at this this half, the way I see this half is outside of you know two mistakes that you know we made that gave them two goals. We've pretty much been in control of the half. Like you know we've we've dominated the ball. We've we've had chances. You know we've definitely been more of a threat in 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 the final third. It's just you know, two mistakes. So I don't know. We can sit here and analyze it in some in some weird way and and create a narrative. But the players aren't, aren't shook. If anything, no, it's it's not it's, it's not it's not it's not it's not creating trying, a narrative, bro. Let's be real, man. They're trying too. They're trying too hard. Or do you know what? Do you know when you you're trying to do too much? That's if anything. That's what they're doing. Like, well, at least a few players on the pitch are trying to do too much. Um. But yeah, I want to big up Erdegaard, yeah, because Erdegaard has had a great half, like both offensively and defensively. He's he's played the game really well. Um, but yeah, I mean, I I, 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 I gave it to Bayern. Like Bayern have been pretty much without the ball for large periods of the game, but in moments they're able to, you know, capitalize off mistakes. And I mean, it's a penalty, right? I mean, the moment the moment is a pen. I don't know. Maybe Jorginho could have dealt with it a bit better. I, I don't know. I see Gabriel. He he pulled out because he thought maybe I'm gonna take him out, but maybe he could have stretched his leg. Who knows? He could have hit the ball because it, it it might have been a pen anyway. You know what I mean? So at least try and go for the. You never know what could happen. But yeah, I don't know. I'm sitting here and I don't have the feeling like we're like we're losing or like we're getting battered or like it's gonna be some crazy uphill battle. Like, mm -hmm. if any but that that's the beauty of Champions League, bro. You don't yeah. need you don't need to play good to lose games, if I win games. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, Brian yeah, yeah. Munchen are, are just showing that they have two shots, bro. Both of them on target, and were two goals, and, well, I mean, and we one, conceded one two goals. Penalty. You know what I'm saying? I mean, one yeah, of one, one of them is yeah, fair. One of them is a penalty, but the other one was one shot, one on target, and it was a goal. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I, and that's what I'm saying with. Um, you have a coach in Tuchel who's won the Champions League. You have a team in Bayern München who's won this competition multiple times. And yes, uh, 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 this is a competition where you don't need consistency to beat one specific team. You know what I'm saying? Because if you shithouse your way into an advantage at, at their home, you can uh, uh, play it safe at your own home. You know what I'm saying? And that's what Bayern München are doing right now. They are at this moment in time playing a defensive minded uh, game 
They're playing on the counter attack and they are exposing our left side with TVR because a lot of times they went to the right. Sane and uh, even uh, Davies. Um, I think they're doing that. Bump. Even, even that's, Davies that's changed the uh, places. That's not because of them, though. I don't think that's because of them. I think that's because of us because we're, we're forcing Nabri into playing a defensive game that really and truly their only offensive outlet is Sane. So in my mind, we should be dealing with that a bit better because we're locking Nabri out the game. I mean, aside from the goal, which I'm pretty sure he came, like it came from the right anyway, and he just ran in um, on the break. Like we've actually been keeping Nabri out of the game, and for large parts, we've been keeping Sane quiet. For large parts, we've actually been keeping their offensive. Like Musiala's just been ghost. Like we've been keeping a lot of their key players out of the game. Like I said, it's just two mistakes. Mm -hmm. That's really just what it is. It's two mistakes. And uh, it, it's, but it, bro, like I said, it's the Champions League. And in the Champions League, it's about fine margins. It's not about playing good. It's not about playing bad. You know what I'm saying? At this moment in time, bro, we are playing uh, like the better side. We have nine shots, three on target, 61% possession, yet we are behind. And that's what I mean with the Champions League is yeah, different in a way that fine margins can determine how a game goes. And in but this game, happen, because, we lost, game. because we lost, because we lost our heads, because no, we lost our heads twice, we conceded no, no, no. two goals. But it's gonna happen in any game. I'm, I'm, I'm not having that. It's gonna happen in any game because you can make mistakes in any game. It has nothing, absolutely nothing, to do with the Champions League. These mistakes can be made in any game by any team, a any game. Like it, it has absolutely nothing to do with the with the Champions. Again, mm -hmm. but in I this case, I, it's I, the I, Champions I, League, bro. The players are not like the players are not out there, like like for example, when when it when I was watching the the Porto game, the the first game, the away game, I was I was watching them play, and I was like, wow, like you actually look scared. Like I can clearly see that you you look scared, like you you look shook, like you don't know what you're doing. I don't have that feeling right now, like at all. Like we literally, mm -hmm. but you don't have to have that feeling for us to be behind. <laughs> no, no, no. But we're still losing, bro. At home. <laughs> because when I came in here, when I came in here, yeah, the narrative that was being pushed is that we're shook. We're not shook. None of the players are scared. They're not on the pitch scared. We're not losing because we're scared. It has absolutely nothing to do. With so, 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 so. Hold on, hooks. Hook, hooks. Hold on, hold on. Because, because the thing is, Saliba right now is playing shook. No, he, no, no, he's not. No, he's, no, no, no. Hold on, no, hold on. He is not. But hold on, hold on. on hold run. on. I watched let me explain. Let me explain. Run. Let me explain what I'm talking about. Let me explain what I'm talking about. Yeah, Harry Kane. Yeah, to score that penalty. Yeah, Leroy Sane, running through. In what, in what mindset do you have to be in where you go in and you put a tackle like that in? What you but know he that was, he's just you know that man. he's just waiting for a but, touch but as um, a man. defender that I know you are that is always composed that is always good with his tackles. Why would you go in for a tackle like that? Why would you because go in for a tackle like that? Sane scores. If Saliba ben White was there, does, Ben White was no, in no, front no, of no, him. No, 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 ben White was there. So so what happened then? We 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 recreating we recreating what happened. Like Saliba comes in because in Saliba's mind if he does not make the challenge, which I think Gabriel should have tried to make, if Saliba does not make the challenge or try to get in the way, then Sane shoots. Yeah, it's a 50-50. Well, actually at that point I don't know if it's 50-50. It's probably more in favor of Sane to score the goal. Mm -hmm. But I mean, like <clears throat> you can't say that a, that a player is shook because they made a late challenge. Like, he has to try and make the challenge there. Gabriel, do you think, do you think Gabriel, Saliba's playing good? Bro, the, what, what, what does... So, I think Saliba, yeah, he's made a few good passes. He's made a few good progressive runs. He's actually charged down the... bottom. He's actually covered most things pretty well. Again, we are losing because of mistakes. Like, and none of those mistakes I can put down to... Do you know what? In my opinion... Both of the mistakes are on Gabriel, if anybody. Both of the mistakes, in my opinion, are on Gabriel because he pulled out of the challenge on Sane when he could have stuck his leg out. Maybe he would have got the ball. Who knows? But with, they got the penalty anyway. Or a penalty. Yeah, exactly. But they got a penalty anyway. So it doesn't matter. It actually doesn't matter because they got the penalty anyway. 
So in my mind, if Gabriel, who was in a much better position to try and stick out his leg than Saliba, sticks out his leg, who knows? Maybe he nicks the ball. I've seen it loads of times. Players stick out their leg, nicks the ball. Yeah, you get the man, but you nick the ball first. VAR, check it. Oh, shit, he actually got the ball. It's not a penalty. Like, on this occasion, he didn't, though. Saying. And then, on the ex exactly, this is why I, I'm saying it's his mistake. And then, on the first goal, yeah, the the the, the, um, the, the Nabri goal, if Gabriel does one of two things, not take the ball away from Raya, yeah, and leave it to Raya, who came out to get the ball, yeah, and he would have just clotted it. Or, once he's got the ball, instead of trying to do some... Some I don't know. I'm Jorginho pass to Kiwior, and just knocks it backwards, and then goes clear it to Raya. We do not concede that goal, so I have to put both of those mistakes on Gabriel. So mm -hmm. again, we are not losing agree, this man. game <laughs> because of our our. And I, I know this is the narrative that everyone's all you are going to paint. Oh, it's the UCL. Oh, in the UCL, this can happen. It is oh. though. No, it has no, to because no, no, no. Is, you, you are no, no, no. Listen, this is, this you are trying to. Mistakes. You, you we, we called this before. The difference oh. between us and you in this specific game is we called this. Okay, oh. you didn't. And the fact that you are sitting here and making excuses for these players, bro, no, and no, blaming and trying to put I'm a blame on a specific no, no. player. No, no, no. Saying, listen, no, you are trying. No, no, no. No, listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me for once. Okay. I always listen. You, at this moment in time, are trying to pick out who is at fault for these mistakes. But, but somebody Saad, and, Saad and me, right now, do not care about who made those mistakes because Arsenal is behind, not Gabriel Magayesh. No, That's the you, difference. You know what I'm saying? And at this moment in time, no, bro, these guys, these guys are just showing what you it. need to do. If you, you, okay, if you are, if you are a side. Who is not playing good football right now, and that is Bayern München because Bayern München at this current time, their form is not good. Yes, before the, before this game, their form was not good. Yes, they weren't playing good football, and they know that. So what do they do? They have this game plan to shit house their way into getting a point or three points, and they are succeeding in it right now. Whoever made those, whoever made that mistake, at this moment in time, we are capitulating. In that, what I specifically told you about the shithousery that teams like Bayern Merchant can bring, they're not because shithousery in that's not what they're doing. That they, they when they get the ball, they're actually trying to attack us. They're just not doing it successfully. That they're actually trying to attack. Like, like, look, we was always going to have the majority of the ball. Do you know why? Because that's what we do when we are at home. Yeah. So Bayern Munich were always going to be put in a scenario where the chances that they get are minimal and they're going to have to make something out of nothing most of the time in the game. The only difference Allah is... Allah, what come have Allah, made... Zinchenko has come on. He's what? brought Zinchenko uh... on. Oh, my God, what has this guy done? <laughs> How has he brought Zinchenko on? How do you look at what's going on and you bring Zinchenko? Uh, okay, yeah, we we've lost lose. this. We've lost this. We've lost this. Yeah, it's yeah, gone. Lost, lost, it's gone. Lost. It's gone. It's a yeah, wrap. Yeah, it's gone. Yeah, it's done. All right, cool. It's, it's, done. Done. it's done. It's done. I agree. It's gone. Damn, bro. What what a shift in energy, bro. This is crazy. Yeah. I'm gone. Nice. Bro, what is nah, going nah, on? Nah, well, nah, well, nah, bro, bro, but T. And uh, in what world, yeah, does Zinchenko <laughs> improve? <laughs> oh my! No, I, I'm God, talking about bro. the shift in energy from going negative to po uh, positive to negative. We all. I'm talking about the game, not about you specifically. Oh, okay, but, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bro. This game, this game went just straight yeah. 180, bro. That's that's what I'm yeah, saying. Bro, it's done. It's done. This it's is done. Mad. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. listen, lads. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. about to start. Yeah. Uh, right. well, yeah. Sorry, sorry, lads. Sorry, lads. We have to go anyway, big up. Let's hope yeah. we can get something out of this. At least yeah, a draw so we can make something up at uh, yeah, Allianz Arena, inshallah. The impossible. The absolute yeah. impossible. <laughs> yep. Anyway, um, listen, big up, big up, big up, big up. Yeah, uh, big up, guys. Oh, my God, man. Oh, my God. How have we brought in Zinchenko? If this doesn't end in the loss, I'm going to be surprised. Oh, my God, man. Oh, my God. God.
Oh my god, I can't believe we've actually brought on Zinchenko. I can't believe we've actually brought Oh my god. Saliba. Erdegaard over to Ben White. Ben White. Erdegaard. Gabriel. Why are you asking for the ball when you're when you're bro, you're marked as in Jengo, please, bro. Just just pull out a performance out of nowhere, bro. Just pull out a performance out of nowhere. Oh my god. Zinchenko's on the ball. Oh, I forgot about the damn timer, man. Kai Havertz. Habits with the cross. Oh. It's unlucky. Offside. Oh, my God, bro. Come on, guys. Please. Don't embarrass me, man. Ref! Jamal Musiala tries to put the ball over to Davies and out for a throw in. This is nuts, man. I can't believe we just bought on Zinchenko, but let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Ball back to Raya. Oh, good God, man. Good God. No, Jocelyn, he's... Uh, listen, if... I have Kivio who's getting... I have Kivio who's getting absolutely hunted. Oh, my God. Martinelli. Kimmick slips. Oh, Odegaard. Ben White. Zinchenko. Oh, Declan Rice, unluckily. Rice chased by three. And that's a free kick. Free kick in a dangerous position, man. Good free kick. Come on, let's utilize this. Come on. Come on. Ben White. Um, Ben White. Declan Rice. Runs! 
Oh. I don't know whether he meant to go for goal or did he just... Come on, Declan Rice, man. Declan Rice, that's it. Come on, Saliba. Quickly. Come on, mate. Come on, mate. Quick, quick, quick. Jorginho. Saka. Declan Rice. Gabriel. Martinelli. Gabriel Zinchenko Oh come on mate don't don't start this don't start this Bro honestly at this point bring on Trossard bring on something we need to get goals we need to get goals we absolutely need to we must Sane, Saliba, here we go, come on Saliba, Havertz, oh. Jorginho to Zinchenko, Saliba, Ben White, come on, Ben White puts the ball over the top, Oh, God. Oh, that's brilliant from Erdegaard. That's brilliant from Erdegaard. Erdegaard is spectacular there. Saka. Erdegaard. Jorginho. Ben White. Havertz, Erdegaard. Ugh. Cool. It's crazy, Sereda. The guys have no self-awareness. They're saying we're arrogant when they're telling us you should win. You should win. You should win. That's good from Saliba. There we go. Jorginho, Zinchenko, Odegaard, look at Odegaard trying to make a run, man, come on, you got to watch that. Odegaard, Zinchenko. Puts a ball into the middle. Unlucky. What has he done there? This is elbowed him, you fucker. Fuck you, Harry Kane, man. You elbowed him. Thank you. 
Erda God. Oh. Unlucky Ben White. Blocked. Erda God. Zinchenko. Come on, man. Pass there just wasn't good enough, man. Declan Rice couldn't get to it. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Here we go. Gnabry. Serge Gnabry. Goretzka, don't let him shoot. Wide. Goretzka. Don't let him shoot, man. It's so simple. Uh, Philip Saka scored the uh, Arsenal goal. Um, Gnabry scored the first goal for... Oh, so unlucky. Gabriel, um, Gnabry scored uh, the equaliser and Harry Kane penalty. Kimmich. Sane. Come on. Press them. Bro, nobody's trying to trying to win no headers. Nobody's trying to do nothing, man. Come on. Eric Dyer. Sane. That's good from Zinchenko. Erdegaard. Saka. Saka still. Ah. Saka. Saka fouled. And that's a good penalty. That's a good place for a foul. That's a good place for a free kick. Brilliant from Saka there, man. Brilliant from Saka. To absolutely open up his body, man, and draw that foul. Rudiger locking Haaland down, is he? Rah. What is the score right now? Is it still 2-1 to Real Madrid? Let me know, guys. Let me know. Odegaard. Still 2-1, yeah? Fair enough. Tash is such a fraud, bro. Tash is actually such a fraud. <laughs> it's crazy. I if I have to be an idiot to believe that Tash did that by accident. Daya, oh my god. Bayern lose the ball there nearly. Oh, actually, no, they don't. They got it back. Oh my god, Sane. Look at the ball from Kane. Brilliant. Gabriel. Here we go. Get it out. Ah, uh, come on, man.
This is the time when you need to bring somebody else on. Okay? Take off Jorginho. Let's see if we can bring on Party. Take off, uh, I don't know, somebody to bring on uh, Tom uh, Trossard. Oh, my goodness. Limer. Over. Madrid is absolutely cooking City. You're not the only one that's in the mud side. Yeah, the thing is, City... Bro, City... Um, what's it called? City is... Um, they have the second leg at home. So they're fine. If they get cooked and they keep it at 2-1, that's fine for them. Because they can cook them at home. But, bro... Us at home... Getting cooked. Eric Dyer in their defense. Oh, look at this. That's brilliant. Erdegaard. Erdegaard. Martinelli. Not a foul. Brilliant. Saka. Oh. That's it, guys. You have to press them, man. You have to press them. Noya. Saka's injured, it looks like. Oh, mate. Please don't tell me that Saka's injured. I beg of you, don't tell me Saka's injured. Noya. Eric Dyer. Um, not Eric Dyer, sorry. Delit. Oh, that's brilliant. Martinelli. Odegaard. Odegaard. Martinelli. Ah. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh, is that a pen? Ah, ref. That has to be a pen, man. Oh, no, it's not a pen. It's not a pen. Here we go. Kingsley Coman is coming on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Martinelli. The oh, licked. The licked with the, with the clearance. We need changes, man. We need changes. We need something to change. Look at Coleman, man. Look at Coleman coming on, bro. Jesus coming on. Leroy Sane. Oh, my goodness. Leroy Sane to Serge Gnabry. Serge Gnabry. Gnabry! Over. Leroy Sane off and Kingsley Coman coming on, man. And Zinchenko versus Kingsley Coman on that side. Bro, this could get peak for us, guys. This could get peak for us real quick. Here 
Here we go. Trossard coming on. Gabriel Jesus coming on. Jorginho. Jorginho coming off. Ross. Jorginho. Martinelli off. Gabriel Jesus and Trossard on. Come on. Here we go, Zinchenko. Erdegaard. Saka. To Jesus. Is that offside? I don't think so. They can rise. Oh, waiting for the shot, mate. Serge Gnabry. Oh. Noya. Luckily, kicks it out, man. Oh, my God. Look at Coleman. Coleman. Kimmich. Kane, don't let him shoot. <sighs> Corner. Oh, mate. Oh, mate. Guerrero is coming on. One sec, guys. I'll be right back. Nero Asana and Serge Gnabry out. Komen and Guerrero on. Corner. Corner for uh, Kimmich. Foden scores from Man City 2 2 at the Bernabeu.
Havertz, Trossard. Here we go, Jesus, Saka, puts a cross in, oh. Zinchenko gets it, brilliant, Trossard, Gabriel, Zinchenko, Ah, come on, Zinchenko. Ball's got to be better there, man. The ball has to be better there. Ball has to be better, mate. Absolutely has to be better. That's brilliant from Havertz. Brilliant tracking back from Havertz. Oh, brilliant tracking back from Havertz, man. I'm shocked. Saka. Jesus. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, get up, Eric Dyer, you scumbag prick. Absolute prick. Get up, man. Get up. Get up, man. Gabriel, come on. We have to start pushing forward. We have to try and get chances now. We have to. Gabriel. Saliba. Come on, Saliba. This is not the time to just stand still and just look around, bro. You need to know what you're doing before you get the ball, bro. I need you quick. Come on, man. Declan Rice, Saka, Ben White. Oh, here we go, Ben White. Oh, what a goal from Josco Vardio. What a goal from Gvardio there, man. Oh, God. Gabriel. Zinchenko. Saliba. Musiala down. Saka. Here we go. Jesus. 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 Don't shoot! Leon Johnson! Johnson Didio! Johnson Didio! Go, 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 go! Golasso, 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 golasso,
come on. What a carry. What a carry by Gabriel Jesus. Oh, my goodness. Gabriel Jesus, man. Oh, sits him down, sits the next one down and bang. The trossard and it's easy as you like, man. Oh. Trossardinho, bro. Now let's go and get the goal. Let's go and get the goal. Let's go and get the goal, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Arsenal. Arsenal SC. That's that's good. Come on. Ah. Oh. Amin, yes, already. Amin, amin. Ya Allah, ya Rab. Ya Allah, ya Rab. Ya Allah, ya Rab. Oh, my goodness, man. Cho Sardinio, man. Cho Sardinio. Noya. Tadaya. Ben White. Come on, look at this atmosphere. Atmosphere is crazy right now. Man, are jumping. Zinchenko. Oh my God. Limer. Counter for Bayern. Alfonso Davies. Back to Dyer. The lift. We need to score another goal, man. We need to score another goal. We absolutely need to. Ah, uh, Gabriel giving a foul. We need a win, man. We need a win. So at this point, I'm taking a 3-2. I'm taking anything, man. Musiala. Oh, my God. Coleman. 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 Raya saves. Saliba, Saka, Ah, 
Uh, tries to get the ball over to Trossard, but just, just can't, man. Guerrero. Tries to put a cross in. And it goes out for a throw in. Has to be off. Not off. Delict. Arsenal. Arsenal. Davies. Guerrero. Davies running. Saliba's on him. Musiala. And back to uh, Dyer. We need to press them 100% T. 100%. They're trying to slow the game down. You see how the, how the centre-backs have split apart now. And they're far away from each other because, look, they want to pass the ball. They want to pass the ball to each other. They want to waste time. That's it. That's it. Press, 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 press. Press. Oh, unlucky. Have it. It's more of that. Come on. Press them. Davies. Musiala. Good. That's a foul. Oh my God, Valverde scored. What a goal. Gabriel. Saliba, Ben White, Rice. Oh, can Saka get onto this? Saka, Saka. Erdegaard. Puts a cross in. No one there. No one there, man. No one there. Uh, party coming on with five minutes of, of game time left. Wallahi, what are we doing, man? Wallahi, what are we doing? Come on, Havertz, run, run, broski. Get off the pitch quick. We need a goal, bro. Man's just walking, bro. Oh my god, bro. Absolutely shocking, man. Goretzka, Musiala, that's not a foul, Rev. What an absolute joke, bro. Honestly, T. What an absolute joke. Party comes on now. Now.
God. Kimmick. Looks like they're going to cross this one in, I think. Looks like they're going to cross this one in. Put in. Dyer leaves it. Trossard's down for some reason. I don't know what's happened. Come on. Let's 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 move the ball a bit quicker. We got 3 minutes left or 2 minutes now. Party. Zinchenko. Get back to party. Erdegaard. Ben White. Odegaard. Well, I just get me a scumbag goal, bro. I don't care. Trossard. You had to make the foul. You had to make the foul. You had to make the foul, though. Five minutes to be added on, guys. Five minutes to be added on. Uh, to be added on. Sorry. Hey guys, make sure to smash the like button for me, please. Why you watch my? <laughs> You're watching my life just fall apart right now, man. <laughs> With this first first leg. <laughs> if this was away from home, I'd be a bit more, you know. I'll be a bit more uh, like content with the with the. Oh God. Oh God. Musiala. On the edge of the box, Musiala. So, oh my goodness, off the post from Coleman. Oh God. Puts it over to Trossard. Here we go. We're making a counter here. Party. Erdegaard. Look at Erdegaard just skip past him. Oh, TP5, bro. Party, you can't do this now, bro. Not now. Oh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant from Jesus. Five minutes added on, man. Five minutes added on. There we go. It's out for throwing. Oh my goodness. So lucky that I hit the post, man. Saliba. Zinchenko. Move the ball, bro. Come on. She's going side to side, man. Oh, we've given it away. 
Guerrero. Oh, Zinchenko, bro, Zinchenko needs to get a grip, man. You get a grip. You get a grip and understand the situation that you're in right now, man. Rice, brilliant. Party, come on. Ben White. Here we go. Jesus. Zinchenko. Ah, oh, Trossard, mate. The touch has to be better, mate. Come on. Get your head in the game, my brother. This is the end. We need to score a goal. We need a goal going into that second leg. We need a goal, man. Saliba. Zinchenko. Trossard. Zinchenko back to Gabriel. Here we go, Trossard. What was that? Trossard, what was that? I know you scored the goal in that, mate, but what was that, bro? Oh, give me a rest, man. Let me give me a break. Give me a break, man. These no, oh, this is crazy, man. Gabriel, come on, Saliba, Saka, Party, Erdegaard, oh, and that's a free kick, isn't it? Ref! Oh my God, how is that not a free kick? Saliba, Ben White, Party, Saka. Oh, that's a penalty! Ref, ref, that's a pen. That's a pen. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. It's a penalty, 100%. That is a penalty, 100%. Nah. That's a pen. He hasn't. Oh my goodness. He's not giving it. Oh my God. That's, oh my God.
anyway, listen. 2-2. Two, two. At the Emirates. Against Bayern Munich. And now we have to go to the Allianz Arena and try and get a goal. It's crazy. Anyway, listen. I'm out. I'm going to go onto the terrace and uh, I've got Mo later. Let's, let's just get this out of the way. Um, like, share, subscribe. I don't know. I don't know whether it's a penalty or not. At first, I saw contact. I'm looking back and I think he threw his foot towards him. I don't know, man. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace out. 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 Peace out.